second point, clarity does not, pos does not bring a serious challenge to the education sector, rather it favors the education sector. Thank you so much for giving me this opportunity to oppose the motion that says climate change poses a serious challenge in the education sector. Before I proceed with my point, Hello, Dr. Good morning. We're going to provide a healthier and more sustainable eating habits among the school community. 3.71 reduction. So, there are many other areas that have used this method and they have turned out to be successful. Examples are the rest grants, renewable uh, energy investment, and desire to control the global resource. create a, a competitive, a critical thinking platform for these, uh, for these students where they can be able to, to share ideas, come up with solutions. We know the solutions are in the minds of these young people, them being the next leaders and the next engineers. The IEK is committed to support such initiatives to ensure that our, our children and our young uh, generation are prepared to come up with innovative ideas on coming up with solutions that affect uh, the lives of our people. People used to have this perception whereby girls are very shy, you know, especially girls from our community that uh, they, they, they cannot even stand in front of people and say one or two things. But uh, you should come to Mandera. Mandera is a land of you know, opportunity and uh, surprises. Our girls should really surprise you. So what I'm, I'm urging, I'm urging uh, uh, the rest of Mandera County schools uh, should also take up the initiative. Climate change is here, climate change is here to stay. And uh, it's up to us, it's up to us to not only to talk about the mitigation but also the adaptations. It's here with us to stay and we must do something about it. This initiative has really helped us and educated us on climate change. It has put us into being agents of change and it has really shown us that we being involved in this and as students we are agents of change, we can change a lot in the climate. So it has really enhanced our learning outside class. It is not just about how, how to conserve the environment, it's also about how we have um, learned how to be confident, how to be um, great speakers. And I think this privilege has really made us get out of the cocoon of being, um, being in just a shell and we've just understood what is there, what, is, what this world in general has to offer.